Hello, this is Rosani. Welcome back. Today we're going to draw some features on a papier mache mask that we made from a neutral mask form. We're going to outline with a pencil. We're just going to put in a few details so that the features will stand out. You can do this any way you like. It could be any type of mask, any kind of creature, any kind of gender. Who knows? What will it be? It's up to you. Create any look, any kind of species, no problem. So moving right along, I'm just putting a little shadow there under the cheeks. So we're just starting out with the basics. We're putting on some eyebrows, just kind of outlining where we want them to go, just to give you an idea. And later on, you could add on whatever you like. See, I'm just pressing down with the pencil around the lips, around the cheekbones, around the nose. There are so many possibilities. Let's get going. Now this can be a wearable mask or a mask that you use just for decoration. Right now, you see that the eyes are open and that's perfectly fine. Do we put eyes in? Well, let's see what it would look like. Here I used two forms on the inside so that I could create eyeballs. You could see them here, how they look on the outside. Then I covered them with papier mache strips. As you can see here, where I've started this mask. And I'll continue on till the mask is completely covered with papier mache strips. But I'll also add a layer of white. Once it's dry, the underside pieces can be removed quite easily. After removing these from the underside, I'll go around the edges with my fingertips and fingernails and eventually it'll just pop off. I just pull it right off and then we're ready for the next step. Be able to see now that where the eyes were opened before they are closed now all I need to do is draw them in so here we go and you can draw them however you like this is just to give you an idea of what can be done you could just pencil it in just like on the other forms these blanks are really fun to use. Make as many as you need. You can always grab them at the last minute and you'll have them ready to go. You can paint on them or papier mache right over them. Add on more features, whatever you want to do. If you prefer to add your own eyeballs, that's fine too, you don't have to draw them in. I just like doing it, but you can insert whatever you want inside of the sockets, no problem. As you can tell, this is a very basic, basic form. 
this doesn't mean that it has to stay like this. You can add ears, horns, eyebrows, hair, mustaches, beards, fangs. You can cover it up and turn it into a scarecrow. You can make a clown face, a skull face, a happy face, comedy or tragedy. It's all up to you. If you want to see me work on more of these, please check my mask making playlist for updates and you'll see how we can add on to these types of masks. If you like this type of video, I would appreciate a thumbs up and I always welcome your comments. And if you'd like to subscribe, I would enjoy that as well. Oh, and by the way, it could also be turned into an animal mask quite easily. It's just a matter of adding on. So it depends on your skill level. If you want to do something basic, just keep it simple. If you want to do something fancy, add on to it and see where it takes you. So I'd like to thank you for watching and for subscribing to my channel. And I'll say bye for now. And I'll look forward to seeing you the next time. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.